The topic of today's video is how to fix Call of Duty Warzone not launching on Steam. So we're going to start off with the easiest and then we'll go into some more intricate fixes. I don't have Call of Duty installed. It's just so big. And then there's another 30 gigs that needs to be installed. It's just too big, guys. First thing you want to do is go to your Steam library then go to your Call of Duty game, right click on it, go to properties. In properties, go to installed files and then verify the integrity of the game files. Let that do its thing and then try and launch the game. Hopefully that fixes it. Next up, go to the actual game files. So you can go to right click manage, then browse local files. In here, we want to right click on the game exe and we want to go to properties. In properties, we want to go to compatibility and you can try running the program in various compatibility modes, test them out, see if that is going to fix it. Though generally, this is not going to work, but give it a try. Different computers, different problems. Run the program as administrator always. Give that a try, apply that. If it doesn't work, you can just switch it up back off again. No harm, no foul. All right, if those don't work, we want to go to Steam, want to go to settings, go to storage, look for the drive that has your game on so g for me click on it and move it to a drive that has enough space now if it's already on a drive that has the 100 plus gigs of space don't worry about the step if it's on a drive that has 20 gigs of storage worry about the step worry about the step very much and move the files all right if it's on the new drive and it still doesn't work we move on to the next step we want to open up our OneDrive and make sure that it is on and that we have enough storage there. So taskbar and click on OneDrive, click on the settings option and then the settings option again. And then we want to go click on here where our storage is, make sure that there's still a lot of storage. Hell, even open up OneDrive so that it's open and then launch the game. And one of these has to fix your Call of Duty. Hopefully it does. Let us know if it did in the comment section down below. Thank you so much for watching. Do consider liking and subscribing and I'll see you in the next video.